हेलो गुड इवनिंग हाय मैम गुड इवनिंग गुड इवनिंग एज यू कैन सी आई एम इनसाइड अ कार एंड एक्चुअली आई एम आई वाज ट्रैवलिंग सो इफ यू इफ यू डोंट माइंड दैट वी कैन नो प्रॉब्लम आई होप यू आर एबल टू हियर मी या 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 मैम आई एम हियरिंग वी आर सो चंदन मीडिया चंदन राइट या या मैम राइट So Chandan, this is, I think, our first session together. So, uh, can you tell me a little bit about yourself? Yeah, right, ma'am. Yeah, sure. Ma'am, as you know, my name is Chandan Mehta. Uh, basically, I am from West Bengal. Okay. I live a, I live a, I live in small city, Bangkura district, in West yes. Bengal. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's my tenth uh, session in uh, on clapping. Okay. so uh, are you working anywhere professionally um, are you engaged in any professional work yeah yeah right ma'am yeah presently i am doing uh, job in a private sector okay. yeah it is related to agriculture uh, product sales and marketing i see that is two years yeah okay so in your profession uh, what is the scope of communication how much do you get to speak in english <clears throat> uh sorry ma'am so in can your you... in your profession yes can you hear me uh, chandan okay. yeah yeah yes yeah, right so chandan in your profession how much do you get to speak in english do do you uh, have to speak communicate in english as well uh, no ma'am basically uh, i live in west bengal where uh, my, my mother tongue is bengali so hmm. basically when i talk with a uh, person uh, but business person i i think uh, good business person uh, when i communicate in bengali so that's right. why there have no there have no scope to speak english fluently that's mm-hmm. why I, i i have a negative uh, on language of english so right. that's why i am i am fascinated uh, about to learn english fluently that's good yeah. and it's good to know that you have taken a step to improve your spoken english skills even though it is yeah, not yeah, a right. requirement for you at the moment you have still taken that step very good how many sessions yeah, have you yeah. completed so far ma'am uh, this is my 10th session already i have completed 9 session on planning yes. that's good yeah uh, and what kind of feedback have you received on your sessions yeah ma'am uh, actually i have got so many feedback for me now uh, when uh, when i join on clapping or that time i have faced uh, some problem uh, uh, like communication and grammatically and vocabulary and also uh, the way of speaking what uh, i uh, what uh, i had said that time so i i i, <laughs> I am uh, afraid that time i was afraid that time afraid okay and to show yeah to show okay. anyone so okay. and now i am comfortable to speak uh, with any person yeah that's a good thing that is uh, something that we also want our learners to become eventually to become confident yeah, yeah. not hesitate yeah yeah. Right? yeah 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 ma'am sir so then uh, what is the what is the topic of the session do you have you gone through the ma'am uh, yeah yeah ma'am ma'am uh, today topic is childhood child okay so would you like yeah, to talk right. yeah ma'am uh, we can talk uh, on the topic and uh, we okay, can so talk so can you tell me uh, how were you as a child sorry ma'am how were you as a child ma'am actually mm-hmm. when i was little boy then uh, i have not when, you, when i was uh, young yeah when i was young so uh, actually i was uh, i was simple and honest because uh, okay. uh, then i think then i was uh, not too much uh, too much uh, uh, i think ma'am the word i'm missing not uh, so comfortable uh, with any person so yeah, i was more yeah. of an introvert yeah 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 right ma'am Yeah, yeah, right. I heard, I heard that word. I forgot. So you were quite introvert as a child. Yeah, yeah, right. So. Okay. Uh, so you think? Okay. Any anything else you would like to share? Yeah, ma'am. Ma- what about the childhood? 
yes regarding your childhood so as a child what i understood uh, is that you were intro you you were an introvert child right you were an introvert yes. child so uh, since you were quite an introvert child did you you must have not uh, you know gotten yourself into trouble any kind of trouble much were you quite mischievous also no ma'am uh, uh, i have forgotten my childhood uh, time because <laughs> uh, i i can, cannot recall right now so i okay. think maybe some happened that time mm-hmm. okay yeah. but over what you remember is that you were quite an introvert child uh you have a lot of friends during your childhood yeah yeah ma'am actually i i can say uh, one moment i want to share to you sure. because uh, i have a uh, i have a childhood friend that that time i wa- i was so close with that friend since uh, since childhood uh, uh, the friend already uh, have touched uh, so many mem- uh, so ma- with so many mem- memories that i uh, i recall recall uh, now so we have spent uh, uh, with that friend and also our uh, memory they have so much with uh, that friend yeah i am happy to uh, that person i am happy so i am happy so uh, okay so what i understand from what you have told me uh, that you were an you were an introvert child number one and that uh, you had few friends few good friends yeah right like- Yeah, not a friend. Okay. Yeah. See, uh, Chandan, my question now is that: Is it possible for a person to uh, be very introvert as a child, but grow grow up to be quite an extrovert and talkative as a person? Is that possible? Yeah, ma'am. Uh, maybe it uh, happened uh, for uh, someone. So, hmm. what you are you still an introvert person? Ma'am, ma- uh, not purely, I can say, <laughs> but mm. I, I think uh, I am uh, not so much. I am little of, uh, 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 yeah. You are still, you are still little bit of an introvert. A little bit of in- introvert, yeah, right. Do you know the opposite of introvert? Extrovert. Of what is? Ma'am, I cannot recall right now. Extrovert. Extrovert means so who, ma'am, who speak more and more. Yes, not only who speaks laugh, more, talk, more. more. Yes, not only speaks more and more, but a person who is able to. Ma'am, ma'am it, it is it 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 is silent, silent boy. Sorry, silent. I didn't catch that. Ma'am, uh, the opposite of a like, silent. The opposite no. word of. introvert the opposite of introvert is extrovert oh extrovert oh extro e x t r o v e r t extrovert someone who is an extrovert is not is not just someone who speaks a lot but uh, is also someone who uh, has a lot of friends see extro look at the word extro intro okay intro is internal so someone who is so we understand that someone who is not able to express their feelings freely so in that way he may not be very talkative someone who is an extrovert uh, not only it is more than talking a lot someone who is an extrovert uh, can easily make friends they like to be around people they like to make sure that uh, they are able to express their feelings because see chandan i'll tell you when you say uh, that someone who talks a lot is an extrovert it may not be the case because extrovert is more than that someone if you want to simply say that someone doesn't have a lot of friends but that person talks a lot that person may be called as a loquacious person loquacious l o so do you have a separate word for it someone who talks a lot okay loquacious l o c a c i o u s loquacious or uh, uh someone who likes to be around people may not talk a lot but likes to be around people hmm. likes to go to parties all those things so uh, that person may be gregarious gregarious okay 
so you have okay. different words to express different aspects of personality someone who talks a lot someone who has lot of friends or likes to be around people okay and and an ext- and and an extrovert is all of that talks a lot has a lot of friends likes to go out kind of a thing okay. i have understood what you mean i will i will get that knowledge about these words yes Yes, because what happens is that often times people uh, think that okay, extrovert. A person is extrovert means a person speaks a lot. A person may not yeah, speak. Yeah, no, no, that mm. that I have thought. Yeah, ma'am. Yes. So a person may not always speak a lot. Yet the person may be an extrovert. How? It is true. Okay, a per- an extrovert is someone who not only speaks a lot. but speaks very easily like whatever comes to their mind they speak it out but an introvert will think twice they may not speak at all doesn't like to uh, always be around people that that person is an introvert okay. all right all right so coming back to the topic of childhood uh, so how many siblings do you have any siblings because siblings play an important role in a person's childhood do you have any siblings no ma'am you are, uh, you are what is what is the mean of sibling ma'am okay siblings means uh, brothers and sisters do you have any brothers and sisters yeah 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 sure ma'am yeah ma'am i have a i have a brother i have a elder brother okay yeah, we have okay. we are actually we are two brothers that's good so you have a sibling you have an elder brother and a younger sister yeah no i I uh, I have a, a brother and I. Okay, so you are two. You yeah. Uh, so you yes. So you, you can also answer this question. Sibling, did you understand the meaning of sibling? Siblings is brothers and sisters. Both will be included in the meaning of sibling. So okay. if someone asks you, Chandan, do you have do you have any siblings? You'll say yes. I have an elder brother. Or you may also say we are we are two of us. We are two of, are of us. Two of us. Yeah. Exactly. And then yeah, you can explain it further by saying that I have an elder brother. Yes, ma'am. We are two of us. I have an elder. Like, if you ask me, ma'am, you do you have any siblings? My answer is yes. We are again two of us. I have an elder sister. Okay. Good. Okay. All right. So, ma'am, I actually, I, 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 yeah, ma'am. When I speak, then I feel comfortable. But when I heard any. uncommon word then i uh, i okay. feel confused it yeah, is possible. that is my uh, ma- that is my main problem right now see don't think of it as a problem it is just an area for you to improve okay so uh, do not yeah, right, you can take you can take our help to improve so you have learned quite a few words today introvert extrovert siblings yeah yeah right ma'am right yeah So well, Chandan. Uh, see, we are heading towards the end of the session. So I just want to want to share some feedback with you. Do we do you want to share anything else? Like any? Do you have any questions in your mind that you want to ask me? Ma'am, uh, please uh, uh, some tips. How I can improve uh, the problem of the word uh, you have already said that uh, uncommon word that that you have already said. So how I will um, uh, solve that problem? See one. How, uh, how, how will be my mind? How I will mind that right. word? How how will you be able to remember those words? Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, right. See, a good suggestion that I can give you is that uh, you can improve your vocabulary through reading. Okay. Do Do you have the habit of reading? Yeah, ma'am. I read, but I cannot um, uh, save the storage in my mind. See in that too, that is okay. What you can do is you may have to put in a little bit more effort when you read and come across some new words. Sit with a book, make a list of new words. You may have to write them down so that you are able to recall them also. Because simply reading may not be enough. You may forget the word completely, and if you forget the word, you will not be able to use the word also. So what I recommend you is sit with a notebook. and if you can just put in a little bit more effort make a list of word words 
and uh, the next step would be to to put the, those words to uh, in in different sentences to put those words to use this that would be the next step first is to create a word list okay okay and okay. on clapping for sessions you can just share the, those word li- uh, particular word list that you have created with the speaker we will help you with the pron- pronunciation and the usage of the words how to use those words correctly will help you with that but on your own whenever you are reading try to create a word list keep adding new words to the list yeah ma'am so definitely <clears throat> i will do for my all right all right chandan so have a good night ahead and uh, yeah. thank you yeah, thank you sure. thank you bye 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 ma'am thank you thank you i'll see you again bye bye yeah ma'am so sure, definitely i will talk to you later sure okay. sure but remember to create the word list chan the next time hopefully you should be able to share some new words with me yes you sure, you sure. definitely will talk uh, with new word yes right yes. okay sure. thank you thank you bye okay ma'am sure thank you bye